Positively Jacks tonight at NES Jacks, where a special ceremony was held today. Call it a tail wagging tribute as its chief master at arms, military working dog Benga, began his next mission retirement. Benga, thank you for your 49 dog years of hard and faithful service. Thank you for making sure your handler got home safe every night. A moving tribute on the naval base, a retirement ceremony for a four-legged service member. <laughs> this military working dog has earned his retirement. As an explosive detector, Chief Benga has been working since 2015, participating in eight Secret Service missions, protecting the president and other dignitaries throughout his seven-year career. Chief Petty Officer, United States Navy, retired, departing. At his retirement ceremony today, Benga earned the Navy and Marine Corps Commendation Medal. The senior chief master at arms told us the military working dogs had the most important job on base. A human nose cannot sniff bombs, they cannot sniff for contained drugs, and what these military working dogs allow us to do is multiply our efforts to protect all the personnel on this base. They're no different than another police officer. They'll protect us, they'll take care of whatever needs to be taken care of, so, and they'll even take a bullet if they have to. Captain Wilfred Villanova with the NAS Jacks Police Department says he's honored to take the leash and adopt Benga into his home. Well earned. He's uh, not only a vet, also a police dog. He's going to go home, be on the couch, and, and doesn't have to worry about working anymore, or looking for explosives, or doing any more patrol. What makes this a perfect adoption? Captain Villanova is retiring too. By the end of September, I'll be gone, so we're both going to be partners in retirement, both on the couch and going for walks together. So well earned for both and for Chief Benga after 49 dog years of service. Now Benga will chase a ball on the beach rather than working out there, sniffing out explosives.